For the 11th year in a row, Trader Joe's has put out a list of their customers' favorite items. Okay. Like, uh, lots of stuff stayed the same. There were a few changes okay. this year. Uh, overall, everything but the bagel seasoning. That always does well. I don't know why. It's I bought not, some. It's really good. It's, is it, it's terrific. Yeah, what it's you, awesome. You put it on what? Like meat or? Uh, I sprinkle it on bagels. I sprinkle it on <laughs> toast. <laughs> mm, okay. You know? Um, I'm saying, like, if you don't have, like, uh, like my, my kids eat those little mini bagels. Mm-hmm. And, you know, I'm not kind of a. plain. I yeah. like it in place of sesame seeds. So you put it's got it more mm. flavor than uh-huh. sesame so seeds. Yeah, you could do you that. You put it on a bagel, you put the cream cheese and put it on top of that. Yeah. Yeah, or I'll, I'll just good. or I'll just butter it and then oh, and put it on I don't even know top. what this is. It's it's, it's a So you know it's like an everything bagel? Yeah. All this seasoning so it's like, you know, onion, sesame onion, poppy, onion, onion, right. onion garlic. Yeah, yeah. it's all oh. sea salt. It's just the seasonings in a seasoning jar. Okay. Yeah, and then you can sprinkle, sprinkle it on. And you can't use it on anything. You can use it on Is it new because I was thinking about it. No, it's been around quite a while. Think about it. I don't think I've been inside of Trader Joe's for over a year. Oh, Missing out. Their yeah. loss. Yeah. yeah. Love it. Uh runners up and I have tried this too and it's actually really good. The cauliflower gnocchi. Oh, oh I have some that. in my freezer right it's now. Tasty. It's really good. It comes Isn't in a little it's in the freezer section. It comes in a little, you know, bag uh-huh. and uh you just get a saucepan. A little you, olive oil in little there. Little olive oil. You mm-hmm. throw them in there. It's really quick to heat up. I will usually just take like Yum. a. It, so you don't even need to use sauce, but like I, I get like a. I, I hit a little bit. Of I hit it with a little bit of red sauce. Right. Yeah. Toss it in the pan and then just dump it right into oh. a. It a really dish. is good. Would you yeah. think it was pasta? It's pretty close. It's pretty close. Yeah. yeah I mean, you wouldn't close. confuse it for pasta. No. Right. But it's really delicious. Is it, it is. pillowy like gnocchi? Yes. I will try that yeah. probably really today. Yeah. Yeah. I really like it. Also in the overall favorites category, our favorite, Greg, the Mandarin Orange Chicken. That used to be number one favorite oh, overall, I think. Love it. That is the best. And the dark chocolate peanut butter cups oh, yes. get in my mouth. Yes, oh my please. Yeah. Those are insane. So good. They no can make them better. Up. You know, why even bother putting the little paper wrappers around them? True. Just, yeah. yeah. Skip that so we can just <laughs> shovel them. Yeah, yeah put oh. them in a squeeze bottle. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, but how is yeah. the JoJo's not on the list every single time? Just not. It's so good. Well, you haven't been there's a lot of good stuff. Here, Menace, I haven't, stuff. but I'm just right. saying JoJo's about the Cubs. classic. Favorite entrees. Now we're getting into the more specific. That, that was overall. overall. Okay. The favorite okay. entree at Trader Joe's, according to their customers' favorites list here for 2020, the Mandarin Orange Chicken. Number yeah. one. It's the, the most restauranty thing you could buy at a store. It's very restaurant It's so good. It is so good. The runners-up are the chicken tikka mas- uh Masala, okay. Mm-hmm. Masala. The cauliflower gnocchi and the butter chicken, which I've not tried. Ooh, that's good. That's really butter good. chicken. Butter chicken. Yeah. Butter chicken. Tried that. Favorite right. vegan item once again: the cauliflower gnocchi. Yum. Uh, we have your favorite sweet treat: the dark chocolate peanut butter cups. Yes. Number one, easy. Deserves it. Mm-hmm. Runners up are the O and H Danish Kringle. What? Yeah, who uh, okay. <laughs> what is that? Ooh, okay. Right that Danish weird. Kringle. Yes. And Kringle. I've had these. These are good. The Hold the Cone mini ice cream cones. I've okay. never got okay. those. You haven't got them? They're yeah. really yeah. good? Yeah, they're good. Mm-hmm. Favorite snack, plantain chips. Boring. Uh, okay. That's very Trader Joe's right there. Yeah, totally. <laughs> Runners up are the peanut butter filled pretzels. Mm. Okay. Okay. All right. And the white cheddar corn puffs. That sounds oh, good. Oh, those are good. Still no love for the JoJo's. No, they're not on the list, How? man. I, I told you because you haven't gone, and yeah, you're may- not. Yeah, maybe if you you're went not in there. The wow. so I used to go to Trader Joe's and Woolworths. <laughs> 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 yeah, they oh, they, they moved, the five they moved on, Menace. <laughs> yeah, the thrifty. Yeah.